Hey, welcome to PNW Enduro. I'm riding a place today that I haven't been to for a couple years now. So this place couldn't get you last year because of travel restrictions in the spring and then fires all summer. This is one of the very few pay-per-use places that we have around me. So you can either pay per day or if you live here, you get a year's pass. So I drove up this morning. It's about four hours to get here. And it's a real treat to ride this place when it's wet like this. Because it's usually really dusty and quite hot so having it be wet like this today is just unreal and that's part of the reason why I made the long drive up time of year I start riding farther and farther away from home as the mountain stuff opens up and try and hit as many places as I can per year. Oh beautiful here. Yeah. So about four hours driving each way is kind of my limit for their bike riding day trips. Uh, let me know in the comments how far you drive to ride and what is your maximum amount you'll drive for a one day ride. A lot of my local stuff is from 45 minutes to an hour and a half. So that's uh, normal local riding for me. But I'm spoiled and I get tired of those places and I wanna see more places like this. like to try and ride I'm gonna say 25 places this year if I can that's the goal anyways last year was a lot harder with uh, border closures and travel restrictions so this year's looking good it's been fairly wet and cool so that's good as far as the fire season so far. Got a couple new things on the bike today. I switched back to my favorite front tire, which is the IRC VX30. I just tried out the IRC M5B Evo front 
and I wasn't really a fan of that tire so going back to what works well for me and I've also put in a new moose uh, SRT brand moose I've been running a heavy-duty tube for the last year on the spike and don't get flats on it but with mountain season coming up I want to be safe I kind of struggled with this bike with the nitro mooses just never felt right on the front end so I'm gonna give the SRT a try I hear good things so we'll see This is the spot I was trying to get to. Uh, I took a couple of wrong turns on the way because I don't really know the area, but uh, not bad. Alright, heading back down the other side. It's a nice long loop. little tough there's a bypass there but wanted to go up that rock face So I think I am doing this trail in the opposite direction of last time because I remember this section and uh, we went down that rock face, not up. So there should be some other cool features coming up here too.
gap. Definitely went up this way before. Remember this section. Cool. keep stopping to take pictures it is so beautiful here right now this time of year everything is blooming and green nice and cool out today pretty stoked that I decided to make the trek up here On this side, it's a little more flowy. It's pretty fun. <laughs> 